Welcome to Lazada, Southeast Asia's biggest online department store. In this video, we will explain how to send your FBL products to Lazada fulfillment centers. We will also go through some of the questions which you may have when using Fulfillment by Lazada or FBL. With FBL, Lazada takes care of the fulfillment of your orders from A to Z. It manages the stocks, the picking, the packing, the invoicing, the shipping and the delivery of your orders. You don't need to worry about operations anymore. You can just sit back and relax while your business grows. Is FBL convenient? Yes, it's very convenient. You don't need to invest in a bigger warehouse or hire more employees to prepare your orders, to coordinate the 3PLs or to manage the stocks. This structure is planned and covered by Lazada. How much does FBL cost? FBL has two fees. There is a handling fee, which covers the picking, the packing, and the packaging material. There is also a storage fee, which covers the warehouse costs. For more information on the FBL service fees, please contact your vendor manager or sales representative at Lazada. If I sell products through FBL, can I also sell other products through dropshipping? Yes. With FBL, you can sell some products through FBL and some others through another fulfillment model, such as dropshipping. Now, let's have a look at three important points about how to send your products to Lazada fulfillment centers. How to create a purchase order. How to prepare the delivery to the Lazada fulfillment centers. How does the inbound process work at Lazada fulfillment centers? For the first step, you can use your seller center account and place an order. How does it work? Step one. On your seller account page, click on the products menu and select fulfillment by Lazada. Step 2. Select the tab Send to Warehouse. Step 3. Choose Create New Request to create a purchase order. Please note that a purchase order can include many product codes, but no more than 90 codes. Step 4. Select the products that you want to send to Lazada Fulfillment Centers and specify the product quantities. Step 5. Select how to deliver the products. There are two ways for you to deliver your products to Lazada Fulfillment Centers. Your company can deliver them to Lazada Fulfillment Centers or you can request Lazada to pick them up. Finally, choose a pickup date. Please don't forget to click Save Draft regularly. With Seller Center, you can also create many orders at once. How can you do it? It's quite easy. Step 1. Go to Products and select Fulfillment by Lazada. Step 2. Select Send to Warehouse and then click Import. Step 3. Download the template by clicking Send to Warehouse. See the sample downloaded CSV template. Highlight column A. Click Text to Columns. Click Delimited and then click Next. Tick Tab and Semicolon boxes, then click Next. Click General and click Finish. The CSV template should now look like the picture. Step 4. Customize the date. Please highlight the entire content of column B, starting from cell B2. Then click the shortcut menu, or use Ctrl plus 1, to customize the date. The Format Cells box will appear. Under Category, select Custom. Fill in the type field with Year, Month, Date, Hours, Minutes, and click OK. Please repeat the process to format date in column E. Step 5. Fill up the CSV template file with the following details. Number. We recommend to include PHFBL just before the number. Created date. Date of export. Status. Leave it blank. Delivery type. Send. Shipping date. Refer to email from sourcing. Comment. FBL request. Product name. Use product name in seller center. Variation. Size for fashion category or three dots for non-fashion. Seller SKU, your SKU number, not the Lazada SKU. Requested, number of items requested by Lazada sourcing team. You may refer to email sent by sourcing. Received, blank. Step six, save the template as CSV. Step seven, select send to warehouse. Choose file, the CSV template file saved in the computer. Then click upload file. Step eight, the system will inform you that you have successfully uploaded the file. There you will see the check mark under the result tab means successfully uploaded. Step 9. Click back to Lazada. 
you have to go back to send to warehouse to check your purchase request number. Step 10. Here you can check the official PR number and all details of the file uploaded. Make sure to check if all the details are correct, especially the quantities and delivery date. Said PR is now subject for approval by sourcing. 10.1. If you click the show details, you can see the details of the uploaded file. Once approved by sourcing, the PO number will be reflected. Step 11. Once the PR is approved, you can now click Show Details under Action tab. 11.1. Now, the official PO number is reflected. Do I need to pay an additional fee for the pickup service of the FBL products? No, the pickup service charge doesn't change and there won't be any additional fees for the FBL pickup. Once you have placed the purchase order, you can start preparing your products for delivery. Before sending your products to Lazada Fulfillment Centers, don't forget about the following points. 1. You need to prepare and attach all necessary documents such as additional labels, warranty cards, or stamps. To avoid any confusion, your shipping boxes should not have any other scannable barcodes except for the product code. If there is any information placed over on the seal of the box, Lazada's quality control team may have to break it to get to the product inside. As a result, the scannable barcode on the surface may be damaged. Therefore, the product label should be placed on a flat surface to ensure that the label remains scannable throughout the inbound process. 2. Please don't forget to include the purchase order and the delivery note. The purchase order needs to display the PO number, the SKU code, the product size, color, quantity, cost excluding VAT, unit cost, total cost, and the addressee. The delivery note needs to display the PO number, SKU code, the product description, and the quantity. 3. Your product must be securely packed. You have to use the right carton box types that fit your products. Filling materials like bubble paper, foam layers, or polystyrene pieces can help you to avoid any damages during transportation. However, please remember not to use small polystyrene balls. Also, your shipment should be clean to ensure good sanitary status. There should be no scratches, no dents on the surface, and no peeling on covering paint. If you want to sell bundled products, these have to be already bundled when coming to Lazada Fulfillment Centers. How long does the inbound process take? Normally, the inbound process takes no more than 24 hours. However, it can take longer if your PO or delivery note has incorrect information or the products are not correctly packed. Are my FBL products covered by insurance? Yes, your products stored at Lazada Fulfillment Center are covered against any loss or damages. Do I need to update the stock on Seller Center? No, with FBL, Lazada will update the stock directly on Seller Center. Moreover, Lazada will monitor the sales volume of your products and help you to optimize your replenishment so that you do not run out of stock and stop selling and avoid unnecessary investments. What happens with the customer returns? Customer returns will be sent back to Lazada's fulfillment center. If the products are in good condition and returned in the original packaging along with any accessories and free gifts, the goods will be stored back in the warehouse and made ready for sale. However, if you want the item back, you can place a return from warehouse order on Seller Center anytime you want. Can I get my products back from Lazada Fulfillment Centers? How long does it take? Yes, if you want to take your products back from Lazada Fulfillment Centers, all you need to do is click Products on Menu tab and choose Fulfillment by Lazada. Select tab Return from Warehouse. Click Show Details to see your requests. You can see the details of the RS request, including the RS order number, the RS details, and the RS status. The overall return time varies depending on the location of your warehouse. If you have any other questions, please contact your vendor manager or our partner support center so that we can assist you better. Thank you for watching this video and happy selling!